Welcome to the 2012 Petties. The Petties is the biggest and only award show for bloggers by bloggers. Tonight we will announce the winners in 10 categories, plus we'll be giving away $20,000 to animal shelters and rescues across the nation. But first, let's get an insider's paw on the red carpet with the host of the Petties, Leslie Smith. That's right, I'm here on the red carpet where you can literally smell the excitement. Cleopatra, I see you're wearing real fur. It's exquisite. Who's it by? <laughs> Juno, it's great to see you at this year's Petties. I've noticed that you brought a mystery date this year. Can you tell us who it is? <laughs> and next up we have Leia. Leia, I see that you're also wearing a green dress. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is a little awkward. <laughs> um, wardrobe! <laughs> Fifi and Rover won't follow you on a leash? Don't worry, you can all follow us on Twitter. The show is about to begin, so come, sit, and of course stay for the 2012 Petties. Welcome and thank you again for joining us. We're thrilled to be honoring the best of the best in the pet blogging community. The first award of the evening is for Best Design Blog. The nominees are Kylie for Amo the Dachshund, Jessica Vogelsang for Paw Curious, Daniela Caride for Taildom, and Deb Barnes for Z and Zoe. And the petty goes to Deb Barnes for Z and Zoe. Deb wants anyone who reads her blog to take that ordinary act of reading and feel like they're on an extraordinary adventure filled with beautiful graphics, stunning photographs, and compelling stories. Deb chose Abandoned Pet Rescue for her $1,000 donation. The next award of the evening is for Best Use of Social Media. The nominees are Stephanie Harwin for Cat Sparella, Paris Parmenter for Dog Tipper, Pam Haroff for Pet Blogs United, and Kim Clune for This One Wildlife. And the petty goes to Paris Permenter for Dog Tipper. Paris reports that many of Dog Tipper's featured animals have found forever homes thanks to social media sharing. Her $1,000 donation will go to Animal House Rescue. The next award is for Funniest Pet Blog. The nominees are Angie Bailey for Cat Lady Land, Abby Rosenberg for Daisy the Curly Cat, Jamie Strobel for Floppy Tongue Joy, and Dorian Wagner for Your Daily Cute. And the petty goes to Abby Rosenberg for Daisy the Curly Cat. Abby loves it when she hears that she's made someone laugh or smile, and she's happy to share a slice of her curly world. Her $1,000 donation will go to Cats Exclusive. Our next award is Best Cause Blog. The nominees are Kevin Hattori for Animal Shelter Volunteer Life, Robin Kraft for Black and Orange Cat Foundation, Alana Miller for Blind Cat Rescue and Sanctuary, and Jenny Threet for Rumpy Dog. And the petty goes to Alana Miller for Blind Cat Rescue and Sanctuary. The sanctuary provides a safe place for blind cats deemed unadoptable by regular shelters just because they're blind. Alana chose Blind Cat Rescue for her $1,000 donation. The next award of the evening is for Best Blog Post. The nominees are Debbie Glovatsky for Glow Girly, Framed, Janice Garza for Sparkle Cat, Clawing Down Cat Myths, Joanne McGonigal for The Tiniest Tigers Conservation Cub Club, Cat Obituary, Farewell Easter Tiger, and Deb Barnes for Z and Zoe, The Controversy of Pedigree Cat Breeding. And the petty goes to Joanne McGonigal for The Tiniest Tigers Conservation Cub Club, Cat Obituary, Farewell Easter Tiger. Joanne says the post is about the heartbreak of extinction and a reminder to care for all animals, big and small. Her $1,000 donation will go to Kitten Associates Rescue. 
And now, a word from our sponsor, Dogtime Media. To kick off the 2012 Petties, we held a pre-Petties $10,000 donation contest, and the winner of the $10,000 donation was the Humane Society of Chittenden County Humane Society of Northern Vermont. Take a look at how this money is making a difference for animals in need. One of the beauties of adopting a dog from a shelter is that they have time to be at the shelter with a staff who knows what they're doing, knows what they're looking at, um, so you actually get probably a more thorough exam on this dog than you would even just buying a puppy. There is an assumption sometimes that all the dogs that are at the shelter are broken. Oftentimes the reason the dogs are here is no fault of their own. Um, they are just victims of a bad circumstance. We're ready. <laughs> the next award is for best video blog post. The nominees are Dogster, The Dog Show, Who's Your Mama? Life with Dogs, The Saturday Pet Blogger Hop, Good Things Come to Those Who Wait. Monique Fisher, for NEBCR Foster's Dog Blog, How Many Border Collies in a Year. And Evan Filler, for Pets Ad Life Blog, Talking Animals and Pets Ad Life. And the petty goes to. Evan Filler, for Pets Ad Life Blog, Talking Animals and Pets Ad Life. The Pets Ad Life Blog is dedicated to spreading the joy of responsible pet ownership. The Pets Ad Life blog will receive $1,000 to donate to the rescue or shelter of their choice. The next award of the evening is for Best Cat Vlog. The nominees are Cat Food Breath, Layla Morgan Wild for Cat Wisdom 101, Ingrid King for The Conscious Cat, and Robin Olson for covered in cat hair. And the petty goes to Ingrid King for the conscious cat. Ingrid's passion is educating cat parents about cat health, nutrition, and other topics that help cats and their humans be their healthiest and happiest. Her $1,000 donation will go to Kitten Associates Rescue. The next award is my favorite of the entire show. We're calling it the Unsung Hero Award. Our goal is to highlight dedicated, unpaid, everyday people who are making a difference for companion animals. We ask the public to nominate an exceptional volunteer at their rescue or shelter. The stories poured in and we were truly inspired by the selflessness, compassion, and commitment of those who were nominated. I wanted to take a moment to recognize our nominees and highlight our finalists for the Unsung Hero Award. It was an incredibly difficult decision, but we're thrilled to announce that this year, the 2012 Unsung Hero Award goes to Lou Hayes, who volunteers at the Humane Society of Cherokee County in Oklahoma. Lou volunteers an average of 40 hours per week, providing everything from general shelter care to fostering to off-site adoption support. He single-handedly established a transport program, which allows an average of 35 dogs each month the chance to more readily find homes outside the state. He manages this program and usually does the driving himself. Lou, congratulations, and thank you for everything you do. Remember to check out all the finalists and their stories at petties.dogtime.com. The next award of the evening is for Best Dog Vlog. The nominees are Ron Levi for the Alpha Dog Blog, Anna Jane Grossman for The Dogs, Maggie Martin for Oh My Dog, and Rachel Phelps for Preston Speaks. And the petty goes to Maggie Martin for Oh My Dog. 
Maggie says that her dogs teach and inspire her every single day. Oh My Dog will receive a $1,000 donation to the rescuer shelter of their choice. The next award of the evening is for Best Product Review Blog. The nominees are Capri for Dog Milk, Lisa Woody for Fun Stuff for Dogs, Kate Benjamin for Modern Cat, and Jamie Smith for Thoughts for Paws. And the petty goes to Jamie Smith for Thoughts for Paws. Jamie says she focuses on product reviews because when she's looking for something online, peer reviews are the first place she turns for honest, non-biased information. Her $1,000 donation will go to Love Astray Cat Rescue. The final award of the evening is for Best Overall Blog. The nominees are Alana Miller for Blind Cat Rescue and Sanctuary, Ingrid King for The Conscious Cat, Joanne Jenkins for My Pet Rescue Blog, and Lori Houston for Pet Health Care Gazette. And the petty goes to Lori Houston for Pet Health Care Gazette. Lori's goal is to provide accurate, reliable, up-to-date information about pet health and pet care. Her $1,000 donation will go to the Nebraska Humane Society. That's all for this year's Petties. Thank you so much for joining us. I look forward to seeing you again next year. And don't forget to check back later in the month for the winner's acceptance speeches. Have a great night.